Hey, Smart Money Community. Hope you guys are doing great. Uh, hey, it's great to be here, with, be back with you with another live here. And today I want to talk about don't hesitate, don't wait, do it now. Do it right now. Now, hey, <clears throat> we're in holiday season. Uh, it's just around the corner here. And here's what we have found, Jen. You know what the stats are around holidays? I don't know. I bet they're either good or bad. <laughs> They're bad. It was broke, 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 broke. Oh, <laughs> that's that's going to be bad. Yes. The current stats shows that the uh, average Canadian, the average American, uh, actually more than the average Canadian, but eighty percent of Americans, eighty percent Canadians, will take over six months to pay off Christmas. Yikes! Before so Christmas just in time for summer vacation. Just in time for summer, <laughs> summer vacation, and within four months later, we're back into Christmas mode, and they do it again and again and again and again. And I repeat this pattern here. And the cool thing about what we've done this year, Jen, is we've had. So so much success yeah with people getting results that they've never gotten in their lives yeah and this isn't just high income earners the majority of people doing this are average income earners are single parents yeah. um with a single income doing this now we do got some outliers who make you know who have a big income but the majority of people are doing this with with uh a single income uh, and, you know, an average income here. And what yeah. we have found, Jen, is the tendency is to put it off. New Year's is just around the corner. We're talking week, like, what are we, five weeks away? I think so. <laughs> five weeks away from the new year. And guys, I want to challenge you right now. And I'm, I'm, I'm going to give it to you the way I would want someone to give it to me. New Year's resolutions don't work. No. They suck. 90% of New Year's resolutions fail within the first six weeks of the year. And so if you're waiting till the new year to get started on your financial game plan, to get out of debt, to do better with money, um, I'm telling you right now, it's not going to work for you. And if that offends you, I'm glad I just offended you. Hi, my name is Mike. I like to offend people. You know? <laughs> <laughs> but it's true. And I, and I love you. And that's why I want to be honest here. The best time to get out of debt, uh, the best time to get on track with your finances is right now. It's today. And I'll never forget this, Jen. I remember when I was like, you know, when I was, you know, we were talking 15, 20, 20 years ago when I had, uh, I remember I was a really chubby kid. And I kind of got to that point where I was sick and tired of being sick and tired. Mm -hmm. and no matter what you told me or, or did, you know, or, or try to put it in front of my face, I wasn't going to do it because I was so determined to hit my goal. Yeah. You know what happened is I decided in the moment to get act to take action. Mm -hmm. And I, I yes. found the best results in my fitness because I didn't say, okay, give me a week. Let me binge three more times and then I'm going to get started. Every time I took that approach, let me do X, Y, and Z and then get started. The results have never been great. No. And so, and I remember this, I remember as a kid, it was in the moment I said, I'm so sick of this. I hate this. And in that moment I said, I'm done, I'm changing. And from that moment on, it was a transformational moment because uh, it took not long, but you know, I shedded the pounds, got lean, got fit. And then I got the ladies. No. <laughs> I remember my parents one time they'd order pizza late at night and said, do you want some? And normally I would say, absolutely. Who doesn't yeah. want pizza at nighttime, right? Uh, but I remember I said no. And it was hard. It wasn't an easy no. It was like, oh, I want it so bad. Right. But I said no. Yeah. Because I had made that decision not long before that moment, that, you know, that pizza moment to turn this around. And I was committed to it. I mean, I was so yeah. committed. I ran. I had bags on me when I ran. If you, oh, if you wow. understand the level of commitment. Bags around me so I could sweat more. And I don't, I don't know if that's healthy or not. But again, I was <laughs> like 13 years old bags around me, a sweater around me. And I, I lived in an apartment building, you know, we know winter is brutal here. Um, and so I ran the building. We had 16 floors. I'd run all the way up, all the way down, all the way back up. Wow. All the stairs, you know, and that was my level of commitment. But what really happened for me was, is because I made that decisive decision in the moment that I didn't fall back. Yeah. And there's so many of you here that I know New Year's is coming up and you're probably going to get emails or see posts of people set your New Year's resolutions set your goals for the new year. And I'm willing to bet that most of you, if not many of you have had financial goals you've set in the past, have had fitness goals you've set in the past. And I say that because when we look at the research, those are the top two goals that people set in the new year, financial goals and physical goals. And what happens is, where are you today? Yeah. How many times have you set a goal like that and, and you, nothing's happened? Yeah. Right. And so I want to challenge you that waiting to the new year is not the good time. In fact, if you want to excel come January, the time to do that now, you have to get that ramp up. 
Yeah. And now is the time to do it. So that come January, you can be successful. But if you wait till January, it's not going to happen. Yeah. You're looking at those spring results. Yeah. Right. Yeah. yeah. If you get there. Yeah. Because most of us will procrastinate on it. There's a, lot of, there's a lot of hype around it. There's a lot of hype around New Year's and all that stuff. Yeah. Setting those goals and it's a new chapter. And the truth is old habits don't create new behaviors. Yeah. You bring the old habits into the new chapter. That new chapter just becomes the old chapter. Yeah. And there's always something else, right? Yeah. Waiting for Christmas, waiting for New Year's, and you're waiting for birthdays, and then Valentine's, and then you're waiting for vacation, and then summer vacation. <laughs> there's there's and always then September. something, and right? Then school, well, okay, the kids back are to back school. in school. Then there's right? Halloween, and then there's Thanksgiving, and then it's just like there's always an excuse. Yeah. Always yeah. Always an excuse to stay broke, to stay stuck. Yeah. Um, and there always will be one. And so the question is, are you really ready to do this now? Because mm -hmm. we have had some humongous success stories. Oh, yeah. Um, I mean, I think Nav posted yesterday or two, a couple of days ago, $115,000 paid off. Yeah. Whoa. It's how unbelievable. Many, how many people can do that in, what was it, a year and a half for her? Yeah. What, about a year and a half? Yeah. How many people do that? Well, she must have a great income. Jen, she, she must be a gazillionaire because pff, I can't do it. <laughs> oh, she cash flowed school. She was in school during this time. It's crazy. Right? She's it's crazy. School, right? Got yeah. a diploma or degree or in school. Yeah. Decisions and sacrifices yes. and determination, right? Yeah. And and not willing to wait, to procrastinate and and wait, right? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Ted and Angie, they joined us last December. I remember the call with them and we had a call in December. I remember because it was cold. I was doing some stuff. I remember being on, I just remember being on that call. Um They've been in debt uh, roughly, I'm going to give a rough time frame, I think about 20 years, you know, in and out, in and out, in and out, typical situation, in and out, in and out, in and out. And they said, you know, they were, I don't know if this is going to work for us, Mike. Mm. Okay, well, come on in. Let's figure this out. Today, year today, over $90,000 paid off. Unbelievable. Hello, did it work? Yes. <laughs> uh same with dora uh, it's not dora doris and oscar hey you guys are watching you know how you guys but they came into the program they said mike we understand that the average person does 20k that will not be us mm. okay six months later 20k paid off <laughs> right? <laughs> right there you go even when you think it can't happen for you it's happening and jen what yeah. i want to celebrate what i want what i want everyone to understand is why don't you tell this year since january of this year so yep. we're in 2021 since January, now we're in November, so 11 months. Yeah. Almost 12 months, we're almost in December, so almost a, low, a full 11 months. What's the turnaround that we have seen in this program with people that have worked, come through this program this year? Yeah. So the total turnaround is uh, just under 1.2. 1 1.2 million. Whoa. $1.2 million. Hold on. Yeah. That was easy. <laughs> <laughs> it was easy to say but i tell you these people worked hard and that's not this isn't we're not talking about four thousand people collectively no, did this off we're talking like less about than 80 about 80 yeah, yeah less than 100 yeah yeah we're talking 80, like a handful like families. A month. yeah yeah so like get that straight we're not we're not that program that has four thousand members you know uh subscription no. all that stuff like like that's like so so when we say 1.2 million dollars over 80 people do the math yeah yeah, it's, it's big, right? It's, these are people that were committed to making a change and they did it. They changed their lives. They were sick and tired of being sick and tired. They didn't like that debt feeling any more than any of us on the team did. Right. Yeah. And yeah. they, they made it happen and it can happen for you too. If you think that, you know, it's not for you, it's not going to work. It works. Obviously you got Divide that, Jen. 1.2 divided by 80, that's $15,000 per person. There you go. That's the average. Yeah. Obviously, some do more, some do a little bit less, but there isn't anybody who doesn't get results. So the question is, are you at that point where you're sick and tired of being sick and tired? Mm. Because this week, we're talking about this program. This week, we're talking about it. We're, this is the last time we're inviting people in this group into this program this year. This mm. is it. This is it because we're busy. We've got clients coming through here and this is a, this is your last invitation to get in and get in at the deal that we have right now, uh, which we're not going to do again. This is it. 
Uh, we're not going to do a deal like this again for you guys after this. Prices are going up. So if you've been thinking about this, if you've been like, okay, testing the waters, okay, Mike, we see people are doing this. Uh, we see you in here every week talking about this, and you've kind of been on the fence. Here's your call to action today. Book that call. Yeah. Now, I just disappeared. I'm back. That call doesn't guarantee <laughs> that we're going to work with you. It doesn't guarantee that I can help you. What that call does is it guarantees we're going to get on the phone with you. I'm going to sit down with you for about 45 minutes to an hour. Me personally, I'm going to be on that call. And I'm going to take a look at your situation. And I'm going to have one of two responses. Holy shit, you're screwed. Or we can help you. Yeah. <laughs> Usually it's the latter. I, didn't yeah. curse. I just realized I cursed. <laughs> I don't normally do that. But it's like, um, man, we've seen it all. You want to talk about your situation. I've seen it a hundred times. Jen, you've probably seen it a hundred yeah. times. Your situation is not unique to you. You may feel that way. You may feel like you're locked in isolation. You may feel like you're the only one, but I can tell you doing this with hundreds and hundreds of clients over the last, I don't know, six, seven, eight years now, your situation is not unique to you. We've yeah. seen it. We've dealt with it. It doesn't scare me. Um, but if that's you, if you are scared, if you're stressed out, if there's frustration, if there's overwhelm, um, if you lie awake at night, you know, if this keeps you up at night, 3 a.m. in the morning, and you're kind of like, you know, this is running through your mind, I want to encourage you to get on this call. Mm -hmm. um, I don't force you to work with us. <laughs> you know, that's not what we do. No. If we can help you, I'll walk you through how we do it. I mean, Jen, today, on our, we just had a team meeting before this call. Uh, a client that we just that just signed up with us and is working with us, um, ninety one thousand dollars. How fast until she's debt free? If she follows the plan, when 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 is that debt free date? Yeah, that debt free date is within one and a half to two years. One and a half to two years, ninety k paid off. Yeah, and she's I don't know, she's been in debt for a long time. She's never like she's never paid off ninety k in in twelve to twenty four months. No, but she's about to. Yeah, yeah, you know, she's on track for that. Yeah. Yeah. And so I want to encourage you. I mean, we've got story after story, after story, after story, after story. If you're, if you're skeptical, head over to moneycoachmike.com backslash results. Mm. And you're going to see story after story, after comment, after comment, after story, after story, after story of people who took the leap of faith, got in here and got that result. Yeah. $1.2 million. Unbelievable. What would you do if you were debt free? How much money would you have if you could be debt free? That changed my Lots. life completely. <laughs> Lots. Yeah. It just completely <laughs> changed my life. Yeah. Now that life hasn't happened. Hey, like the AC went out this summer. The furnace mm -hmm. is gone. The roof is leaked. Uh, the cars had to be repaired. Like life still has kicked me. But yeah. Being debt free has allowed it to be so much more freeing and stress free. Yeah. Yeah. Because you're, pre you're prepared for it, right? Yeah. Everything is no longer an emergency. We, yes. we course correct and we're able to go on in peace rather than, you know, fall back into, into fear and panic mode. It just, there's so much more clarity, so much more opportunity, so much more freedom, freedom of choice, oh. freedom of, of thought. Speaking of freedom, um, right? It doesn't feel like there's yeah. a lot of that these days. <laughs> No, it doesn't. We don't, no, <laughs> we don't have that kind of time. We don't have that time. And it's not that kind of show. But freedom. Yeah, you talk about freedom. I mean, freedom to make decisions like Christmas this year, where most yeah. people are going to have to sacrifice or go into debt. Yeah. To buy for Christmas. We're going to have a lot of fun this year. Yeah. And we ain't going into debt for it. No. And it can still, it can still just feel so good. It feels so good. And it doesn't have to be extravagant and, no. you know, but you can be, you can make something special. You, that freedom even comes like freedom of space in your mind, right? Oh, to, to be creative, freedom of time to spend yeah. that time. Like if you're a quality person or qual <laughs> that came out wrong, quality time person, <laughs> there we go. There we go. That's what you, mean. <laughs> you know, like your, that's your love language quality. Time. You free up time to spend with those that you love. Yeah. Right. Like just, there's so much more opportunity. So, so exciting to be able to live in that space. And that's what we really want for you guys. We want you to have that, that freedom of time, that freedom of space, thought, finances. That's the freedom that we want you to experience. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah exactly. And so here's the deal. If you've been that person that's tried to get out of debt, maybe you've done it. Maybe you got out and you went back in. What I found is most people can get out of debt, Jen. 
most people can't stay out of debt. Stay out. And they fall yeah. back in. Uh, and our goal is when we're people is to get them to stay out. Yes. Get debt free and stay debt free once and for all. So if you're that person that's maybe paid off some bills and or credit cards and racked it back up. Mm. If you're that person that's trying to bankruptcy and you're back in debt. Or you've tried a consumer proposal and you're back in debt. You tried to budget and it's not working. Um, I want to invite you to be that person to book that call. Mm. Because I can tell you right now, hands down, hey, if we can help you, hands down, your life will be better off six months from today than it will be on your own. Hands down. Mm. Hands, hands down, without a doubt. Now, if we can't help you, I'll tell you that. I'll be the first to tell you that. I don't tell many people that, though. There aren't many people I get on the phone and say, oh, I can't help you. Almost nobody. Um, yeah. So if, if that's you, if you're sick and tired here, if, if, you, if you, like, again, if you lie awake at night, frustrated about this stuff, if you're worried about, you know, how you're going to pay bills, if you're, if, if the debt's overwhelming, like, don't do it alone. Yeah. You don't get to excellence by doing it alone. Amen. It's the same with your finances. And so we love you guys. And I know we usually come in here and we do some teaching, but this week, this is the last time we're putting a big thing up there in the next couple of days. Uh, tomorrow uh, or Friday, it's ending, but we're just putting a big offer call out there for those who want to change their life once and for all and want to do it now and not wait till the next available opportunity. What I found is the next available opportunity never happens. There's always something else that shows up in your life. And so if that's you, get in because uh, we're, doing, we're doing a huge, huge deal for everyone right now. Huge, huge deal. Awesome. We're not doing this anymore. This is it. Uh, this will be the last time we do the deal, the program this way. It's changing after this into the new year. And it's cool. It's changing. And it's going to be even better, uh, I think. It's always, we're always trying to make it better. But right now, the success in this program over the last 12 or 11 months has just been astronomical. $1.2 million. Yeah. You can That's buy a huge. house in the GTA with that. <laughs> right? <laughs> you can buy 10 houses almost anywhere else with that. <laughs> but yeah, that's what we're talking about here. And so... I, Straight up, we're not more. Inf- we're not going to give you more information. We found information doesn't solve problems for the majority of people. Uh, information is just that. It's where you know it's where the dime a dozen. It's it's you can find it anywhere. Information is not what you lack. What you are missing is straight up the hands-on accountability. Someone to be there to help you take action. Someone to be there to help you take the next step. What step do I do in what order? Yeah. How do I not get overwhelmed with this anymore? Hey, I was talking to someone last night who said, I was like, what have you done? What have you done so far? She's like, oh, I follow this budget person and they've taught me how to do the budget, but it's just, you know, I'm like, yeah, they're giving you information. They're not holding you accountable and helping you hold your hand step by step. And so this is for those who want that accountability. Hmm. That's how people are, you know, people always ask, well, how did so-and-so pay it? They must be rich. How did so-and-so pay off 15K in four months? They must be rich or they must have two incomes. It's not that. It's that they have accountability. It's yeah. that they got a mentor, someone who knows, someone who is where they were and is now where they want to be. Yeah. That knows the pathway to success and says, don't do that. That's not going to work. That's going to add an extra two years to your problem. Do this yeah. and pivot yeah. and pivot. That's why this, people are getting such big successes. It's because they yeah. got that. And so if that's what you want, hop on that call, moneycoachmike.com backslash call. You'll see some times there. We don't have a ton of availability. We got a little bit here. But if you're that one, hop on. Again, if I feel we can help you, I'll walk you through what we do, how we do it, explain it all to you. If I feel we can't, I'll still get you connected with some resources to get started. But hands down, I just want to say, don't wait till January to get started because you won't. You'll get you'll get jazzed for about a month and then you'll fall off. And January will be, you know, 2022 will be like 2021, which will be like 2020, which will be like 2019. See the cycle? <laughs> It's repetitive. <laughs> it's repetitive. So if you want to make the next 90 days your best 90 days, if you're ready to kick butt in the debt for good, get debt free, stay debt free. Yes. Get out of stress, get out of overwhelm, the frustration, the fear, the anxiety, get rid of that crap. You know what to do. Awesome. All right. We love you guys. I want you to be the next success story. I want you to be the next person hopping into this group and celebrating paying off 20K. Yes. Your dream screen. We're debt free. <laughs> that's what I want. That's my dream for you guys. That's where I want, I want to take you guys. Any last words of wisdom, Jen? Uh, just don't wait. There is no time like the present. Yeah. Um, if you've been feeling this pull for a while and putting it off, like make the call. Talk with Mike. Yeah. You know, 
you're going to get an honest answer and some clear direction on, on where to go. And so we would love to help you. We love you guys in this group. Stay connected. Um, stay in budget this holiday. <laughs> uh, and we hope to be working with you real soon. Awesome. All right. So I'm going to love you guys. We'll talk to you soon. Bye. Bye for now. <laughs>